Hello pal, just want to jump in and do a quick tutorial on how to use Flipgrid for this activity to celebrate our school. Uh, Flipgrid is an application that you can download uh, for both iOS and Android for either a smartphone or a tablet. Either way it works, or you can actually use it uh, online by going to flipgrid.com. But I'm going to show you using the application uh, natively here real quick. So once you actually have downloaded the application onto your device, as you can see, mine is in the bottom right-hand corner. Go ahead and click on it, and it will open up for you, asking you two questions, if you're a student or if you're a teacher up at the very top. For this activity, we will be students, and you will have to enter a grid code for the very first time that you actually use it. Uh, the grid code for this activity is Palomino Pride. So go ahead and put that in there for you, and then you click on Go. It will bring you to the topics that are available for this particular grid. We just have this one for week one last week. Uh, and it does have an intro video, which is a welcome back to school video. It's really, really nice done by Old Navy. You can uh, preview that video by click clicking on the video itself. If you choose to view it, it's up to you. Otherwise, to get to the part where you add your response, you simply just cl click on the grid. You can see other people's responses already and listen to those by actually just clicking on the response itself. And you can hear it, you can actually reply to it, which we'll talk about in just a second. And then you want to actually add your own response. And as you can see down at the bottom in the green area, it says add response. You click there and it will automatically open up your camera here. Uh, you will have to give it permission uh, to use the microphone and the camera for the very first time. Uh, afterwards, it will not ask you again. However, uh, when you are ready to record, you want to pay attention to a couple of things. You do have your volume uh, mic meter uh, that's in the bottom left-hand corner of your screen. And then you have the timer. For this activity, we have 90 seconds to provide our response. The question is actually here in the body part in the white. But then all we have to do is select the record button at the bottom in red to begin our recording. Now what's really cool is you can upload an already pre-made video if you choose by selecting the upload button which is in that green circle. But for right now let's go ahead and press record and what you will see is the dial beginning to fill up in red around the pause sign letting you know that it is recording but you will also see the timer uh, counting down in the <clears throat> bottom left hand corner of the video screen. Now you go ahead and record. When you're done recording, you can do two things. You can either hit pause, just in case you want to add anything else to it, that pause will allow you to do so, and it will just be one continuous video. Otherwise, if you're ready to move on, you just simply click the green circle with the arrow pointing to the right to move to the next step. If you don't like it at all and you already know it, the beautiful thing is we've got the redo, which is the red trash can, and click on that and it will start all over. However, if you are satisfied and you just want to review it, you click on the arrow here. I'm going to turn the volume down. This is where you actually will hear yourself. If you're satisfied with what you hear, once again, that's the green circle with the arrow in it to the right. If you are not satisfied, you have the redo. You click the red trash can to start all over. Since we are satisfied, the next step is to take a selfie. All right, and you can decorate your selfie with the smiley, uh, sorry, with the smiley emoticon. Uh, you can do whatever. Let's see here. I don't have a horse in here, but uh, whatever it is you like. My daughter seems to like the ears. You know, you've got different things that you can actually put on here. It is resizable. I like the crown, so that I can actually make it a little bit smaller to fit in between the ears if I choose to. You know, it's completely up to you. The pencil allows you to draw on the body as well. Once again, same process. Red trash can, I do not like. I want to start all over. Green arrow with the green with the arrow in it is to move on to the next step, which is the final step, and that is to put your name in. The other uh, options are optional, the email address, and you put an email address is if you want to know when someone replies to your response. A title, which we'll go over in the uh, upcoming weeks. Uh, for this one here, I'm actually going to put in the hashtag Palomino Pride, <clears throat> and then I'm going to uh, leave the link blank, and then I hit submit. And now that's done. I return back to the grid. I immediately see my response uh, along with the other responses that are there, and 
voila, that is it. That's all you have to do. If you have any questions, I will be uh, pretty active in the Facebook group uh, this year. Um, I will be glad to answer any questions there. Just, just let me know. Thank you, and have fun.